Well, my mom and my um friend of Cherry, um, they're local activists, and so oh, they've done activist work since we moved here, uh-huh. and um, so yeah, they created a lot of ill will towards not just them, but towards their children as well. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. So you saying even before this happened to you, your mom was like a local activist in the city. Me. Oh, and, and here I'm just trying I'm trying to get some perspective from my own thinking. Is Paris, Texas pretty small? Like a place where like most like everybody know each other kind of? Yeah, pretty much. Oh, so they knew who your mama was too. Yeah. Oh, so I'm sure when this happened to you, your mom had a lot to do with the protest then, right? She had a lot to do with being like an advocate. She was already an advocate for her people, but some shit like this happened to her daughter. I'm sure she jumped into action. Yeah, it was actually um, a situation of um, they were going, you know, to the schools to help with situations where. You know, ultimately, the teachers, you know, they don't tell the truth a lot. And so Mm -hmm. they were going and actually digging into things, seeing what happened, and then the things that weren't true, trying to get those things removed because, you know, that stuff follows you Mm -hmm. all through school, and it paints Mm -hmm. a picture of you for the next grade, you know. So they already Mm -hmm. have this perception of who – they think you are just based on what comes across your file. And so Mm -hmm. this was actually um, my case was a case of pure um, what do you call it? Uh, Retaliation. Mm -hmm. It was that's it. It wasn't, I didn't go really go to jail for per se as they're saying I pushed the hall monitor. It was solely based on the fact that if we can't do anything to you, then we'll do the next best thing, and that's your children. And they yeah. not only just targeted me, they targeted my brother, and they targeted my cousin, my aunt's son. Like They had to be removed from school, and I was the only one that was still left in school because mm. I wanted to go to school. Mm-hmm. And so um, that's the situation that happened. It was um, the principal that day that um, this happened actually told my mom that he wanted to personally see me prosecute, prosecuted. Hmm. Damn, damn. It's it's so sad to hear these kind of stories. And Shaquan, that's one of the reasons why I started my platform, like the name of my YouTube channel is Melanated Fathers TV because I'm a you know I'm a black man, 41 years old. I have I have five kids. I have four kids by the age of 